sort of a, an earlier rendition of it. This definitely harkens back to that. And yeah, I think they're pretty flat. And it is Hawaii. Tom Beatty, second leading scorer, gets it up to Christensen. Little show and go. Went for the jam, but he got blocked by Trimble. Well, one of the things you're going to see, Seth Trimble, if you haven't watched it, one of the best athletes in the country. He's showing that with his shot blocking ability as well. Here's RJ Davis, and that's a good sign for North Carolina. Counted as a dunk, but it is a putback, and Hawaii on the board. Yeah, regardless of whether it's a dunk or not, it still counts for two points, the first two for the Rainbow Warriors. Elliot Cadeau quickly the other way. These guys get up the floor. In a hurry. And there's what gives away. <laughs> <laughs> it's a friendly crowd here. As they have come out in droves to see Carolina in person from Yokohama, Japan. Played for Team Japan in the Paris Olympics this past summer. And another turnover here. Snatched away by Ian Jackson. Ahead. And Davis with the reverse. Wow. Once again, that's the pick six. Knocking down two threes already. Has six of eight points for the Rainbow Warriors. R.J. Davis shovels it, and it's thrown down by Van Allen Lubin. He was able to catch and lay it up as he saw his teammate in trouble, didn't stand waiting for the basketball, made it happen. Jalen Washington, nice cut to the hoop. Because they want to get up and down, and North Carolina forces you to have to play their pace. They're going to run after makes, they're going to run after misses. Even against the zone, they don't want to wait, and you see the beautiful cut off of six offensive rebounds. So they've been beating North Carolina at their own game, even though the Heels still hold an eight-point lead. Lubin, that was a tough turnaround over Jacobs, and he got it to go. Another great cut by Jacobs, not standing and waiting for his teammates to throw the basketball, but no recognition. Five years was the man in the middle for the Tar Heels. R.J. Davis, the teardrop. Under four minutes to play here in the first frame. Cadeau with the crossover move. Goes up with the left, the finish, and one. Wow. One minute to play here in the first frame. Davis the step back. Ha <laughs> ha. This Hawaii zone has done the job here. Ian Jackson, though, the zone breaker from outside the arc. And he rocks the rim. And Chris is showing off his veteran leadership and expertise and experience in the paint. However, you can never relax. Now under 10. And Christensen lost the handle. Numbers for the Tar Heels. Bounce pass RJ Davis, the layup is good. Now that's what the Tar Heels didn't right at the rim. They were unable to take advantage of, but get a good, quick one here to start the second. Cross court, this is Trimble for three. Yes, for North Carolina. And a little over a minute, and they wrestle the ball loose again. It's Seth Trimble. Bounce pass again, Cadeau. And that's a welcome sign for the Rainbow Warriors. The struggles have been imminent throughout the first half. Only 2 of 14 from beyond the three-point arc. And right back at the other end, Elliot Cadeau. You make a three, you're excited about it. Maybe things are going in your favor. And just like that, Elliot Cadeau's breaking down your defense and then taking the cookies. Yeah, picking a pocket and ahead it goes to Trimble for the throw down and one as Cody Williams got underneath him. So Trimble will have a three-point opportunity. But a smart play by Cadeau because, of course, normally two McDonald's All-Americans and Ian Jackson and Drake Powell coming off the bench. So as a starter, you don't have a choice but to perform. Nice pass underneath and the finish. Five seconds to shoot. Davis off the jab step. Too strong with it, but the offensive board and followed by Washington. The goal right now for the Rainbow Warriors is finding Nemo. You gotta make it happen. You knew it was coming. Meanwhile, Trimble finds a cutting R.J. Davis. Especially at this stage of the game, that cost you in a number of different ways. Coming up behind the back dribble, Cadeau, wow, finishing with the left. Different level of competition than what he's seen at Belmont. 
and it takes a while to get used to that. And of course, in a different role before, he was kind of the guy. Now he's just one of the guys. Well, this guy has been good themselves, obviously, in Auburn and Iowa State. North Carolina will tip things off against Dayton as the last game on day one on Monday. And Dayton, who does also have a Maui Invitational title. Tyson going back over the left shoulder. That was a nifty move. Nice Beattie from New Zealand. Nice play by Beattie right there, recognizing that he had the advantage. Tyson, that is a splash from the corner. On Sunday at 8 Eastern on ESPN, 8.30 Eastern, Drake and Vanderbilt again on ESPN. And so a strong crowd here in Honolulu as Jackson takes it to the hoop for good measure. And Hugo Davis gave him the okay to take the shot and not take the violation. Oh. Well, Basahan almost with another answered prayer there from midcourt. But that is how this game comes to a close. 80 plus points in the first four games this season for North Carolina. First time since 21 22.